406 opponents batting average yep. in this stadium. Now here's Casale hitting one deep to left. Back on the track, Adusi, and that ball is going to be off the top of the wall. That came close to going out. We're going to have Casale stops at the second base, and Joe Madden comes out. Mike Maddox, the pitching coach, started to go to the mound and has pulled up before he got to the first baseline. And Madden wants to talk this one over with Joe West to see whether or not that ball actually went out of here or not. We are going to have a home run review, you would think, the old fashioned style, not necessarily a challenge, just the home run review, which was in play last year before the fuller implementation of the review system came about. You can see it's clearly on top of the out of town scoreboard out there and against the back wall. You see the depth in the uh, wall and the scoreboard. And in every situation like that, it makes it difficult, especially to the naked eye, mm -hmm. to figure out exactly where that ball hit and whether it's a home run or not. And remember, where we're looking at it, we're well above the height of the scoreboard. The umpires on ground level are looking up at the scoreboard, so they can't necessarily see exactly where that ball lands. What they're ruling now as a double is that the ball hits the pad and comes back, but there's usually an indentation on the pad if it hits the pad. It hit that grid or the wall behind the padding, but from the field, that's a tough call because you don't see it clearly. If it hits that pad, you're going to see some sort of indentation there, which was not apparent on that replay. But is that clear and convincing enough? Well, that's the question, isn't it? And there we have uh, Joe West and the plate umpire, Marty Foster, in communication with Command Central as they try to determine if this is a double for Casale. Or his first major league home run. Hopefully, Kurt will be able to celebrate this one in delayed fashion. We'll find out in a second. Mm. They're going to leave him at second base. So, uh, not enough evidence there to do anything but leave him at second base. 